Hello YouTube, this is Frugal and this is a plea for help. Don't go elsewhere. I'm not asking for money. I'm not asking for time. Nothing like that. I want to show you something called Simmers Without Borders. Now the guys at Navigraph have started this initiative and the idea being that they want to get everybody in the flight sim community to unite in trying to find um, a vaccine ready to treat the COVID-19 virus that's going around. You don't have to give anything. You don't really have to do anything. All that they're asking that we do is download some software called Folding at Home, join their team within that software and just run the software. That's it. You don't need to run it while you're simming. You don't need to run it while you're playing games. But anytime you're not simming and you're not play playing games, if you're able to just leave your computer running and leave this software running, then it will contribute to the global fight in working through 3D simulations to try to figure out uh, what, how the proteins behave basically and try to come up with a vaccine to counter it. Let me show you through some of the stuff here. This is simmerswithoutborders.org. If you go here, click on join the movement, there's three things you can do. You can contribute as a simmer, simply download the client software, install it and run it. And you'll be asked to enter a team ID and set your username. That's it. That's all you need to do. All right. If you want to be, if you're an organization, you can encourage, as they say, your members to install the client as individuals. So all you organizations out there, I know there's many of them watch this very channel. I've supported you guys over the years with the new show, uh, driving traffic to your products and your product announcements. Now you can help the community as well by joining in on this. You can also tr contribute as a company. If you're used to running cloud services, then you can set up some cloud instances to run this as well. And then what's going to happen is once the software is running, this is how it looks. It's very simple. Uh, Navigraph can track how the team as a whole is doing, and they link here to the Folding at Home team stat page as well. And then within that team, we can see how individuals are doing across the globe. So this is a chance for you guys to compete. And again, I gotta stress, you don't need to spend any money. You don't need to buy anything. You don't need to hand over your time. All we're asking you to do is download the Folding at Home software, subscribe to the uh, Simmers Without Borders team, and then the times that you're not using your computer, just let it try and contribute to this incredibly, incredibly worthy and vital cause just by doing what it does. Computing. It's as simple as that. Simmerswithoutborders.org is where you can find everything you need to find, including the link to download the software. There's a handy FAQ there. I'm going to hand it over to Magnus now from Navigraph. He's going to talk you through it in a lot more detail than I could. I'm going to go ahead and download the software. There's something we flight simulation enthusiasts have in abundance, and that's strong computers. To render all that nice scenery and flight dynamics, we need strong CPUs and powerful GPUs. Even if you'd like, you're not going to fly all the time. There are hours of the day when your simulator computer is just sitting there, and here's what we propose. Give that computing power to someone that needs it. Hey, we hope you're feeling okay. These are strange times we're living in. The coronavirus is spreading like crazy. People are getting sick. Hospitals and healthcare systems are under great pressure. And some of us are getting laid off. Worst of all, some of us are losing near and dear ones. Maybe you feel just like us. Man, I wish there was something I could do. Well, there is. In addition to the usual washing your hands and practicing social distancing, you can do something else. You can donate your computing power. Let us show you a way in which flight simmers can help in the fight against Corona by supporting another type of simulation. A few days ago, a couple of our developers here at Natograph asked if we couldn't start a pro bono project to support the fight on Corona. Me and Magnus thought it sounded like a great idea and here's what we're going to do. We're going to donate computing power to support protein dynamic simulations to speed up the search for a Corona vaccine. And you know what the good part is? You can help too. Have you heard about Folding at Home? It's been around for 20 years and it's a platform for distributed computing to help in the simulation of protein folding. You see, a virus is a protein and it changes structure in order to bind to other proteins like the cells in your body. Researchers want to simulate how the protein folds and moves in three-dimensional space to better understand how it behaves and which other structures that help in creating a vaccine. These simulations are incredibly complex and demand a lot of computing power because some of the steps in protein folding happens very, very quickly. Here's where you can help by offering your simulator computer to do part of the work. 
we have named this initiative Simmers Without Borders. And we would like you who are watching this video to click the yellow button on simmerswithoutborders.org and learn how to download your own distributed computing client to help researchers find a vaccine against Corona. We want to rally the entire flight simulation community for this cause. To track progress, enter the team ID of Simmers Without Borders into your client software. All the work your computer does will count towards this team ID and we will be able to follow the progress on leaderboards on simmerswithoutborders.org as well as on foldingathome.org. Let's show the world what the flight simulation community can do. Here at Navigraph, we use cloud computing instances to render the graphics that go into our Unroot chart product. We have tested to install the distributed computing client on some of our powerful instances, and it works like charm. You as an individual can install the client on your simulator computer, or any spare computer for that matter, and other companies and organizations in the flight simulation community may want to look into getting cloud instances. No one can do everything, but everyone can do something. So click on the yellow button on simmerswithoutborders.org and get started right away. Thank you.